So to start off, these are the products that we're going to use. We're going to use curls, which can actually be found at Target. For conditioner, we're going to use the coconut curlata. And for styling, we're going to use the curl creme brulee. Of course, you're going to start off with dry hair. And the only thing you're going to do is by wetting your hair. Now once your hair is completely wet, you're going to use any shampoo that you choose to use. I'm actually using a no sud shampoo. It really helps lock in my moisture. And it keeps the hair, my hair from drying out. So that's something that you guys should look into and try. But it's the no suds shampoo. It doesn't have the sulfate in, I believe. Okay, so after your hair is completely clean, you're going to put conditioner in there and let it sit in. Make sure that your hair is completely soaked before you put the conditioner in. Depending on your hair length, you do not have to use a lot of this. Um, since I do have short hair, I just use enough about, looks like about a teaspoon worth inside of the palm of my hand. And I simply massage it throughout my hair. Now this is a conditioner, so it should sit in for a few minutes. And have a good time massaging your scalp in your hair to help lock in that moisture. And maybe do a couple of songs and ballads and Construct a orchestra as you wait. Do a little dance. A little dinner. Check out my muscles. All right, now you're going to rinse out the conditioner. I usually rinse my conditioner with cool water. Now as your hair is still soaked, you're going to put the curls creme brulee in. This is a soft hold styling product. I love this. This is probably heaven sent for me. And again, with your hair soaked, you're going to apply this to your hair and just kind of get in there and, and make sure you completely get all of your hair. I usually take a brush and comb down my hair. This is, you know, a wrap brush. Just comb down my hair to shape my face because I do wear my curls in my face. So here you see me just combing the curls down just so that there's not too much tangle all around my head. Now this also depends on the way you wear your curls because if you wear your curls out of your face you would actually brush your hair out of your face. I look like I have like the bowl cut that they used to give the little boys. <laughs> Okay, now once you have completely your curls, you know, loose and, and straightened, you're going to style them the way you want your curls to look. Once your curls are styled, you're going to use a diffuser. Here you don't see me using a diffuser. Um, and if you don't have a diffuser, then you can do what I did and put your temperature on medium or low and warm, not hot, and just go through and kind of press your curls. Um, the point of the diffuser is to continue to have your curls while your hair dries. So here you just see me putting the dryer on curls and keeping them scrunched. This is a good replacement for a diffuser if you don't have one. Okay, once your hair is you know pretty dry it may not get fully dry but pretty dry you're going to wrap your hair and the reason why I wrap my hair is just to lay down the back because it's curly it comes back up in the back but that soft hold in that scarf does wonders and it really lays the hair in the back down flat 
I never thought I'd have a scarf on my head on YouTube. <laughs> See, so here I'm just showing you guys how it's going to make the back of my head flat. But I still want the curls at the top to stay loose so that they don't get squished. Now you're going to let this sit on your head for a few minutes, uh, maybe while you apply your makeup. Or maybe while you sing a song. Or maybe while you read your favorite magazine. Once you've let it sit for a while, you're going to take your scarf off. Of course, it's going to be kind of stuck to your head. But all you have to do is pluck out the curls from around your head and um, shape them again to fit your face the way you want it to. So I'm just showing you guys again the front and the back and the top just to show you how it looks after the process. And what I like about the curls creme brulee is that your curls are still soft, but they're still a hold. Alright you guys, I hope you enjoyed the tutorial on how to style short curly hair. Make sure you check out GeminiLounge.tumblr.com.